A slow speed police chase on I-295 this morning led troopers to a stolen box truck inside empty caskets. The Florida Highway Patrol says David Ayers stole the box truck last week and may have been involved in several other burglaries. News for Jacks reporter Jennifer Reddy joining us live from Northwest Jacksonville with details on the man deputies arrested behind the wheel. Jennifer? This slow pursuit lasted for several miles earlier this morning and ended here near MLK Boulevard and Moncrief Road. I want to show you over here. This is where that truck was eventually stopped and there is still some shattered glass on the road. We are told that is from a broken window in the truck, but right now it's unclear exactly how that window did break. In the meantime, we are learning a lot more about the suspect, David Ayers, who we are learning was wanted in two other states and is now facing several charges here in Jacksonville. After leading troopers on a slow speed chase in this stolen box truck, David Ayers is now behind bars. The speeds were not excessive. The speeds only got to about 55, 60 miles per hour on the interstate system. Troopers say Ayers reportedly stole the rented rider box truck from a casket company in Jacksonville last week. It was spotted this morning by troopers near I-295 and Wilson Boulevard. When they tried to conduct a traffic stop, troopers say Ayers kept driving for several miles before eventually pulling over off MLK Boulevard. After opening the truck, troopers discovered three new empty caskets slightly damaged, along with what appears to be the payment system from a car wash vacuum. There were some additional items in there too, um, to where it possibly looks like this subject was uh, perhaps in the Jacksonville area um, doing some other burglaries, uh, various tools and um, some other apparatus that was in there. Ayers is now facing several charges, including theft of a vehicle and property. As for what's next in this investigation, troopers are trying to determine if Ayers is responsible for other burglaries in our area, given some of those other items that were found in the truck. Jennifer Reddy, Channel 4, The Local Station.